the thing is I want to say like about misgendering for example if like for it's very hard for, but what I kind of try and get cisgender people to grasp is that there's the kind of like you know if you just want to understand it superficially it's polite you call people what they want to be called that's true but it's not just about like impoliteness because fundamentally what someone is saying when they misgender you is everything that you've like worked so hard to assert about yourself against like all odds people whose families over this people like risk violence is I have the power always to take that away and to say that you are not what you say you are and that there is some essence that you can never run away from, which is what trans people have been told over a lifetime. So, like, it's inherently, um, you know, it's inherently a very psychologically dominant act um, and one that's upheld, you know, by the power structures in society. Like, ultimately, if all of society and the state chooses not to recognise us, then we have no, you know, we have no power in that. We are aware that we're a minority. So it's a very dominant bullying... Mm act on a deeper level as well as just being rude.